So guys, today we're gonna talk about these Land Cruisers. So yeah, bye guys. special place here in Pampanga guys I mean this place is somehow hidden because uh, hindi naman siya publicly open for everyone that that everyone could go in because private property siya ng uncle ng friend natin so uh, it's IC's uncle this this has been featured in uh, Buzz Hype's vlog already but we'll st we, we will still vlog it because uh, I'm really interested with the stuff that he owns because I personally have that interest on his taste of cars. So yun nga. Uh, so iba vlog din natin yung mga kotse niya because I'm really really excited about it. Tapos uh, titingnan natin ko anong mga meron doon na kotse. Papakita ko sa inyo isa isa. I'll try to give you an in depth look. Si ano nandito. Si Bella. So let me introduce you guys to Bella. Bella, come here. Hi Bella. So this is Icy's dog. I see an Eman's dog. This is the new dog, the puppy Bella. So yon. Tapos, uh, we had a, quite some party last time here. Kasi birthday ni Eman. Yon. Birthday niya kapon. So yon. Happy birthday Eman. We brought the Lexus LX450 of our good friend. Inerab natin to. So uh, later we'll bring it to a car wash na. Kasi syempre ginamit natin. And we need to clean it up before returning the car. So yon. Uh, but now we'll be using IC's. Hi Lux, so yun bro, punta kami kay Latito, so let's see kung anong mga meron nandun. I'm really excited, so see you guys there. Bye! So guys, uh, we're currently here on a secret location for this vlog. Uh, again, na vlog na to ni Buzzhype. If you want to see another video for this part of the vlog, you can check his YouTube account. Uh, pero guys, uh, I'll give, I'll still vlog it kasi ito nga yung mga hu hilig natin. I, alam nyo yan, I personally have a preference for these kinds of cars. Kasi, uh, even us meron tayong isang ganito. But, not to di this extent pare. Para siyang, uh, parang medyo times 10, ganun. So, I'm really excited kasi nga, uh, yun. Sobrang pag tinitignan niya siya, yung mga kotse, it's like really nice, really clean. He knows what he's doing with those kinds of cars. So yun, makikita natin, mapapakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung mga to. So yun, first, before I let you guys see the cars that I want you guys to see, I'll let you see IC's Hilux first. So, this is the Hilux of IC. This is a 4x2G Hilux, but still, uh, ano lang, syempre, nandito sila sa province. Somehow, you need a, a pickup car para syempre sa mga pangkarga and all. It's running on Cooper STT Pro. That was a SCS din siya na, yan yung 5 spokes ng SCS na Gen 1 if I'm not mistaken. It's a TRD grill, tapos a TJM siya na suspension. So yan. Ganyan naman talaga. I mean, yung mga Hiluxes naman, usually ganyan yung itsura. They need to be really simple, nothing too extravagant, nothing too, nothing do, not, not, not those kinds of uh, front bumpers the steel na sobrang exaggerated uh, so for me simple cars uh, like this would really i would really prefer this one over some uh exaggerated pickups so yun uh, so ready na ba kayo i mean i'll let you guys see kung ano yung mga papakita ko sa inyong kotse so i'm really excited but firstly i just want to you guys to meet my friends so tumatalo na sila for excitement so yun there's Iman, i see and D5 and of course Joseph. So yon. This is the bad boss hype group too. So yon, yon, yon. So ito na yung mga kotse guys. Say say natin. Ito ito to 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 mo na to mo na. Ito maganda dito bro. Ito favorite ko bro. Oh bro. Ito favorite ko. Yan yung favorite ko. So K truck na. Ah uh, dump. Nagda dump to. 
So solid. Angas, di ba? So yan. This is a K-Truck dump car. Uh, Siyempre, may mga purpose na kailangan mo mag-dump. So this one, malahing bagay yan. So, ako personally, I have a heart for K-Trucks. Uh, kasi, hindi sila masyadong nabibigyan ng tuon pansin. Kasi, there are workhorses here in the Philippines. Eh, but, sa Japan, ang daming pumaporma na ito. Di ba, Japan? Jo, ang daming pumaporma na yan. So, yung mga K-Trucks, medyo underappreciated siya sa atin. So, I just want, kung meron niyang mga builds na ganyan, Actually, may nakita akong isang nag-build na ganitong itsura, si Mafi. Si Mafi Yutan, he built one that is really, really nice. Uh, para spaceship gray, tapos may cab sa likod. It's really nice. Sobrang ganda for me. So, yun. Uh, there's a stock Jimny here. This is, uh, this is the top of the line, GLX, I think. So, kasi yung top of the line ng Jimny, it's projector headlight already. Tapos may headlight washer. So this is this is a top of the line Gemini. Tapos if I'm not mistaken, the color is ivory. Yan ata is ivory. So medyo ni research ko siya kasi I want one, but still not now. But yan a stock, a stock. Baka naman. Actually, 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 Suzuki. I'm not sure if I'll be publishing the video. Uh, if I publish a video already, but uh, I already talked to the Suzuki management. He'll, they'll be lending us a uh, land unit of Suzuki Jimny. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. So, yun. Uh, LC2. Of course. This is everyone's dream. Land Cruiser 200 is always there. Alam naman natin na sobrang ganda ng LC2. So, this is a Dubai. Tama? I see. Dubai na edition ng LC2. 0.3. This is a 0.3. Kasi yung fashion niya, yan yung harap niya. Tapos, interior-wise, Oh shit, hindi nakalak. So later. So still. But this is LC2.3. LC Tapos naka Dubai body kit siya. Ito. Kasi usually the locals doesn't have this one. Doesn't have the rear part. Tapos yung step board I think it's the same. Pero yan. Ito yung LC2.3 na Dubai. Then going here. There's a... Actually okay. There's an there's an ar argument for this car. And then that one right there. Kasi itong mga itsura na to. Uh, they call this rebirth, this one, the blue one. This is a 76 rebirth. But uh, I talked to some Land Cruiser guys. Uh, this is not the real rebirth. Parang kasi nung 2001, 2002, there's, there, have, there, there's, there was a rebirth edition ng Lumabas na ganito yung itsura. Ganito. Itong white. Same, same with ours, yung 76 natin gray. Ganyan yung itsura. This one was the rebirth daw. Yung ganyang itsura. Uh, yun yung naka-AJ engine tapos uh, it was released way back um, around 2001 and 2002 so yun uh, eto sa, uh, ang sabi nila this is the reproduction of Land Cruisers I'm not really an expert of Land Cruisers but still if you have you have your opinion just comment down below if you want ko anong opinion no, na tama but uh, that was explained to me of, from a someone na talaga nagla Land Cruiser so yun uh, let's say ito na lang yung 76 na reproduction. This is a 2018, 17, Wait, um, ito yung first 16. Release, bro, ng first release. Rebirth, reprod na 2013. Okay, kasi ang unang nilabas na mga reprod is V8. Tama? Uh, oh, yes. Tama, V8. Kasi yung mga later on naging... Ay, hindi, may, may V8, may HJ, sorry. Yes. Yung later on kasi puro V8, yung HJ, nawala na yung HJ na, re, na reprod. So yun, this is really nice. The color is really good. Sobrang gusto ko yung kulay niya kasi syempre, alam niya naman, mahilig kami sa blue. But this one, this one's really classic. The look the looks of it is really nice. Tapos, pucha, ito may, ano, may bump pala to, no? Tapos considering that one, there's a hood scoop there. This one has none, right? So yan. Ganda ng kulay, pare. So, the blue shade of this car is phenomenal for me. It's really nice. That was, of course, oh, Spectre Off-Road, uh, Land Cruiser. This is States. States. Came from States. Spe Spectre Off-Road. Nice bait, LX edition. So, yan. Ang ganda, ang ganda. Because it's running on tall and thin BFGs. I think this is a KM3. So, it's running on... Mix, mix yan. 255, 65, 16. Mixed siya. Kasi KM3 ito, KM2 yung likod. Ayan o. No? Yung KM2 kasi is pa ganun. KM3 is may nipin. But it's running on tall and thin tires. It's really nice kasi yun nga yung na-appreciate ko ngayon. Yung mga LC ngayon na tall and thin. Tignan nyo kung gano'ng anipis yung goma. So that's the look of a tall and, tall and thin Land Cruiser right now. 
kasi hindi lahat nagtotolentin. Kaya nga ako tayo, yung, yung 76 natin, ay yung LC natin, ginawa natin 265-7516. Coming from uh, 285-7516. So right now, we're running on 265 na. I want this size na 255-8516, but uh, yun nga, uh, nang nakuha natin is 265. But nonetheless, it's taller and thinner. So yun. This one's really nice, guys. I mean, super pogi. Even the inside. Diba? Ayan. Beige interior. Ganda. To be honest, I'm not really an expert with the interior colors of the 76. But this one, is a, it's a manual. Sobrang ganda. Ayan. Sobrang linis. Sobrang linis. Buksan natin. Hood. hood ba to? Tama, hood. Yes, sir. Wait, wiper ah. Sure? Yep. Oh no. Okay, ito pala yung HJ. Yes, yun yung kasi. Ito yung HJ, kaya siya unang release kasi yung mga HJ nga no, wala as I've said a while ago. So it ito, ito yung HJ na reprod and solid, solid, solid. Hope ito kasi ganda. yung Yan na yung V8. Uh, okay. Kaya siguro may hood scope. Yes. So ito guys, uh, ito yung sinasabi nilang bulletproof engine ng Land Cruiser, yung HJ. This one's the same with our Land Cruiser na, na engine, but yung amin yung 2001 or 2002 version siya. And this one's a manual transmit. It has a manual transmission. Ours is a automatic transmission. So ganda, solid. So yan, steel bumper, ARB, IPF, fog lights. Simple lang, simple lang. You don't need those uh, uh, malaking mararaming stuff to make this Land Cruiser stand out. Kasi ito yung mga coaching. Pag nakita nyo naman yan sa kalsada po siya, titingin naman talaga kayo. So ito, this one's uh, 75? 79. 79. Yeah. Okay. Kasi this one's, this one's a dual cab na may pickup. Yan, kita nyo, kita nyo. Ayan. So color naman niya is somehow grayish. Dark gray. Ang, this is a darker than ours eh. Ang Para, sabi nung uncle ko bro, uh, nung in order, actually itong dalawang orders na to, I'm not sure with yung mga uh, LC fanatics yun. Sabi niya kasi ito, um, something anniversary, Australian are, anniversary oh, color siya. So, this color. Oh, kaya, na, siya, na, na, walang, na, na, kaya wala siyang side decal. Wala siyang livery um, or et, what. Ito naman, um, Australian anniversary color din siya noong 2018. Tapos wala din siyang side decal. Gets, gets, gets. So yun, uh, ito ang ganda rin ng kulay to be honest. And, tapos yan, it's a functioning hood scoop kasi ayan o, oh, diba? Bukas sya dyan. Tapos ito yung tall and thin, ito tingnan nyo kung gano'ng kadalaki yung difference ng mga goma. Kung ano yung mga nagiging itsura ng auto pag nagpapalit ka ng size ng goma. Yung iba kasi, they think yung mga goma na yan, uh, same same lang yan but no. Uh, this is a 255-8516, this one's a... I think this is a 265 or 285. So 285, 7, 6, 285, 16 to. So yun na nga yung point. So yung lapad, malaking bagay yan. Malaking bagay yan. So to, PTO winch, meron na rin to. Kaya siya may cover dyan. Tapos, ganda. Ganda na ito. It's one of Mickey Thompson, by the way. So, tapos yan. Oh shit, may ganito rin siya. Solid. So yan, V8 nga to. Solid. Grabe. Ganda ng makeup. Grabe to. Tinanggal niya yung rear bumper pro kasi nung pinabahan niya. Tumama. Ah, uh, oo. So, ganda, ganda, ganda. So, ginagamit talaga to ng pang mga farming. Guess nyo. So, interior. Sweet. Shoot. Sarado. So, nakalock siya. Bubuksan ko ito. Hindi, joke lang. <laughs> Tapos yan. Uh, this one's a V8. Uh, ito yung mga engine. Again, yung mga LC expert dyan. But still, I'll try to give you a, an idea of what the engine is. This is a V8 ng LC200. But, single turbo. So, ito yun. Uh, sobrang ganda ng makina na to. For the body. Kasi, syempre, it's a classic body that has a new heart. So... Pretty much galing ng Toyota doon. Sobrang kudo sa Toyota for making that edition. Kasi syempre, diba usually pag mga lumang itsura, gusto nila luma na rin yung engine. But this one pare, I mean it's a new engine on an old body na ni-reprod. So ang ganda na naman nun. So okay, going to the next. This is a, this is the old one. Alam ko ito yung luma. Kasi ito yung grill ng LC talaga na luma compared to that one. So yan, this one is a fire truck. 
These are the legit fire, fire truck of Land Cruisers in Japan that was imported here and then um, they made a cab for the re for the rear ito ito ginawa to para tinanggal yung technically may ano dito fire truck hose and water water stuff tapos ito ginawa na to para dito yan so si si na yan to tapos usually the the ambula the, the fire trucks in Japan it has it has a bubble top this this is somehow higher than the, than this so kailangan mo siya chop and then you need to weld some stuff up there to make it more rigid tapos yung interior naman niya ito this is a okay ito yung kinuwento ni uncle last time oh by the way it has sunroof so yan uh, tapos yung i think ito yung pang mga fire truck na to eh. so everything is working kasi si uncle is also a fire volunteer so somehow that's that's in, included that you so, so that you can use the sirens kasi syempre kailangan nila magamit yan tapos yan yung mga audio controls yung pang mga walkie talkies so yan nandyan sa lahat so guys uh, ang malupit dito sinabi na ni uncle to last time the engine is really interesting pakita natin yung engine Bab tatama kaya to baba na lang natin so yun ang ganda ng ano, ah, fender mirrors so I like the fender mirrors for this one kasi usually yung mga ito na fender mirrors to eh. So yun. Uh, I think this is a fire department logo. May fun fact daw dito eh. Sa Talaga? Eh, Hindi ba ano yan? Fi parang firefighter badge? Parang yan nata yung badge nung sa, sa Japan. Sa Japan to fire. So it, it, somehow it's really cool. Okay, palit yung mga ilaw niyan. Koy ito pa yan. This is the grill of our LC din dati. Uh, that's why we changed it to this one. Kasi this one's modern. Yun nga yung sinasabi sa inyo na this is the rebirth. This is the legit rebirth. Yung ganitong itsura, ito yung rebirth talaga. So, ito. So, ang ganda. I really like it. So, ito. Uh, bubuksan na natin yung engine nito. Okay, si Tito, kinausap ko the other night, uh, they, he revealed that this engine, uh, ito na yung 1HDT na matic, kasi gusto niya maging matic to. So, nilagyan niya ng 1HDT from an AT, tama? Yes, sir. From an LC80, nila, sinalpak niya dito. Tapos, yung makina na ito, nilagay niya dito. Kasi, fire trucks has really low mileage. Uh, when, syempre, sa Japan, yun yung mga uh, fire trucks naman, hindi masyado ginagamit. So, wala na masyado nasunog dun. So, usually, fire trucks ng Japan has like a thousand to ten thousand mileage of their life lang talaga. So, yung mga makina nila, sobrang sariwa. Sobrang solid ng mga makina. So yun, uh, from, for this fire truck kasi gusto niya gawing matic. So, he installed this 1HDT matic from an AT. Para sobrang solid to kasi yung 1HDT na matic, sobrang tulin yan. So okay, yung makina niya naman, nilagay naman niya dito. Okay, so sobrang solid yun. Kasi yung 3F na to, from a 3, yung 3F na to, napunta dito, yung 3F na to, sobrang sariwa to. So sobrang lupit. Kasi, nung sinarto ni Uncle, sobrang panalo, sobrang pido nung makina. Sobrang ganda kasi, uh, this is all stock. Walang arte-arte, talaga mechanical. Everything is mechanical. So, yun nga, uh, this car is somehow really good kasi uh, talagang all out na na-restore na, na sa Tapos, ito pa yung malupit. Ito, inaawit ako kay Uncle to. Sabi ko, Uncle, I really like the steelies pare. Tingnan niyo yung steelies niya. Sobrang ganda kasi may mga steelies na, maraming steelies ngayon sa market. But, hindi kaya kumain sa large hub eto yung manual locks kasi yung mga steelies na gitna nila yung hub nila maliliit eto malaki ito sobrang ganda kasi na BFG KM to rin sya so, ang ganda ng kulay puti guys yung mga kotseng to kaya may mga battle scars kasi ginagamit talaga to pinangfa farm nila to and talagang hindi sila yung mga babies lang talagang he bought these cars for really good purposes so yun ganda nung ta ganda nung ta sa, sa likod grabe may heart talaga ako sa ganito ganda no Favorite niya ito bro, kasi puti. Oh, ganda. kasi dumating ito, yung axles niya lahat may LSD na. Oh, tama-tama sinabi rin ni Tito last time yun. Sobrang solid, pati pang hinalim guys. Sobrang solid na itong puti. I really like this one. Tapos interior wise, ayan, grabe. Orig left na yung dashboard niya. 
Tapos yung steering wheel niya ganda pa rin. Actually ito mas type ko tong steering wheel na to compared dun sa amin. Sa totoo lang ha. Kasi mas classic. Pero hindi ko na alam kung ira correct ba talaga sa. But still ayan. Solid grabe. So yan. This is the interior for this LC. Sobrang ganda. Ganda ng puti. So turning. Yan yung baby niya. This is the baby. Yup. You already seen this car because this was posted already by by Buzz Hype and nakita nato sa BGC. But still, guys, it's really nice to look at it in person because ibang klase yung dating ng auto. Ang ganda. Yes, but this build is from under chassis to fender to bumper. Tapos yung side decals nya bro, painted on yun. Oh shit. So yeah, hindi sa sticker. Galeng galeng. Pati yung kulay nya. Ako yung kulay nya sobrang type ko. Ah, eto kasi yung mga if I'm not mistaken, eto yung mga clips to para sa windshield, tama? Pwede mo ibaba yung windshield para dito sa uupo. Sobrang solid, grabe. Ano makina na ito? AZ din? Alam ko, ito, solid. Damn. Grabe. Pero so, yan. 5 speed. Sobrang solid. This is a manual. 5 mm. speed. So, ito. Kita nyo. Kita nyo. Kita nyo kung gaano kaganda yan. Look at it. Look at it, pare. Sobrang ganda. Diba? So, hindi ka makakita ng mga gantong Land Cruiser from time to time. Kasi itong mga Land Cruiser na to, somehow they are well kept. They are somehow ganyan, nakatago sa mga warehouse ng mga probinsa. Kasi yung mga ito, ah, talagang ginagamit to. Hindi sila yung mga tago lang sa, tago lang sa garay sa Manila, yung mga nakatago sa village, ganun. Hindi. Sobrang solid. Like, ito. Ano ito, uh, hindi niya mapalit-palitan yan eh kasi original Ito. Toyota siya na oh. amber light. Solid na ito. Tapos sa... talagang inilawa. Talagang binungkas. Ito. Dito sa harap yung Toyota. Oh, no. There's the Toyota logo at the bottom. This one. Ayan. Sobrang solid. Ganda, ganda. Kulay niya actually. I really like the color. Ayan. Ganda yung kulay. Ganda yung kulay. Side mirrors. Ganda yung side mirrors. Ha? Parang manual side mirrors but still it's nice. Gusto. Ganda pa rin ng bed. Grabe. So yan, yung mga ganyang detail. Sobrang ganda, grabe. Imagine yung magkatabi yung puti at atong blue. Crazy, crazy. Tapos eto, OG. OG stickers. Alam nyo na yan. Land Cruiser Club of the Philippines. It's been there for, since 1998. 4x4, not, not roads not required. Pero guys, uh, yan yung mga stickers na malalaman mo somehow na yung mga owner ng mga gocheng to. He's really OG. And he knows what to do with the cars. Kasi... Ah, Siyempre yung mga ganyan, hindi ka naman tatagal sa ganyang clubs if talagang walang alam eh, di ba? Parang through time, the experiences is there, tapos matututo ka na lang. So yun, kahit tayo, hindi naman tayo expert eh. Kung bagaman natututo tayo lahat, through time and experiences. So yun, sobrang solid yun. So ito, interior-wise, yan. Ganda. So bench tayo pa sa dito. Dashboard, rig left na. Ganda. Yes! interior. Hell yeah! Yes! Ganda, um, ganda, ganda. So, ito lang. Ang ito. disadvantage lang nito bro. Pag medyo, alam mo pag yung height mo medyo... Matangkad, no? Oo, oh, kasi ito na siya. Kasi sobrang close, pare. Sobrang ito, close. Pa, Tinan mo, simple, ano lang ito, ah. Flex lang ito, ah. Sobrang solid. Yung... Holy crap! Okay, alam nyo bakit flex yun? Alam nyo kung bakit flex yun? Kasi guys, yung mga ganyang starting sa mga lumang kotse is freaking flex already. Kasi yung mga gantong kotse naman, yung mga lumang kotse, hindi naman sa ano. Pero ang hirap i-start, lalo na pag carb, yung mga ganyan. Pero ito, kita nyo naman kung gaano kabilis mag-start. Ang lamig ng aircon pare, sobrang solid. Ganda, grabe. So ito yung mga babies ni Uncle. Diba, Hi C? Yes sir. Solid. Ganda. Ganda ng kulay na ito. Pati tumunog ng engine. Sobrang pino guys. Sobrang pino. Pogi talaga ng otong ko. Grabe. So, for the 70 series, they have one, two, for the blue one, two white, red, three, four, five. So, they have five. Sobrang solid. Ganda na ito, grabe. Gusto ko magkaroon ng pickup car, pickup na LC talaga. Okay, we're done with the 5 LC70s. So now, we're finally going to my favorite one. This 40. Grabe. Grabe tong 40 na to. Grabe. Grabe lang. Grabe lang. 
Kasi ito yung mga otong, ako pangarap ko to. Literal, sasabihin ko pangarap ko to. Kasi it's really hard to come by sa ganitong kotse. Plus, sobrang mahal mag-restore na ito. Kumbaga, may makikita ka man sa marketplace. Yes, maraming nagbebenta. But, if you want a restored one, it will go up to 2 million pataas. Sobrang taas. Meron pa sa states yung FJ Company. Diba? Alam nyo yun naman yung FJ Company. Yung FJ Company, pag dinig nyo sa Instagram, grabe pangarap namin yun. Pag dinig nyo sa Instagram, it will cost you, magkano yung iman mga 10M, diba? 10M Philippine Peso. Grabe yun, sobrang freaking crazy. Diba hindi pa shipped yun? So ikaw, papataksan mo pa and all. So that's how delicate this car is. Kung baga hindi biro mag-restore ng kotseng to. Tapos ito, pinapakita niyo Tito last time, sobrang lupit. Kasi... Uh, for example, this one, this shade, it came from Dubai, ah, and Australia. Sabi niya, it's, it's, it came from Australia. I think this is brand new for the condition of this one. Ganda, ang ganda nito. Plus, ito yung pina favorite ko. Sabi mo ay tito grab ito. Ito yung soft top, brand new, brand new tong soft top niya. Tapos, uh, it's made na pwede ka mag aircon sa loob. Meron kasi mga soft top na syempre, soft top yan. So yung mga clippings niya, pwede lumabas yung mga hangin. So ito guys, hindi lumalabas kasi ito yung ginawang soft top na pwede kang mag aircon sa loob. Sobrang solid nito. Grabe. Pati yung, oh, even this one. Oh, Spectre Off-Road for the rear. Ganda ng plaka. Grabe. Sobrang ganda ng 40 na to. Wala akong masabi kasi ito talaga yung pangarap ko. Soft top 40. Grabe. Interior pare. Pare. Grabe. Yung interior sobrang ganda. Sobrang ganda. Bench type na upuan sa likod. Tapos lahat ng buttons nandyan. Aircon meron na dito. Ah, grabe. Toyota mating. Tech start mo. Jeez. Ikaw na mag-start bro. Takot ako. Baka masira ako pa yan. Di ba? Pero still. Ni Stinart to ni Uncle last time. Sobrang pino ng kotseng to. Wala akong masabi. Sobrang lupit. Sige. Okay na lang. Sobrang lupit ng kotseng to. So yun. Uh, Siyempre. Yun nga. As I've said. Mga 40 guys. Hindi biro. Panalo to. Sobrang panalo to. So yan. Paparinig namin sa inyo engine. It's all stock. Grabe. Ito, ito ba? Yup. Engine niya, sobrang stock lang. Pina-explain ni Tito, lahat ng nakikita natin, it's all stock. Tapos, came from Toyota. Grabe. Sobrang lupit. Makakita ka ba ng ganyang engine na ganyan kapino tumunog? Tapos, all stock talaga. Came from, I don't know, freaking 80s, 70s. I'm not really sure with this car anymore kasi patay, hindi pa ako, hindi pa, puta. Ano pala ako nun, tamad pala ako nun. So wala pa akong alam. Diba? I don't freaking know, pare. Pero still, I, we learn to appreciate these kinds of cars. Kahit hindi na natin siya naging era, still, we appreciate them. Kasi ito yung mga coaching, uh, sila yung tumatak sa history ng car industry. Especially the Land Cruisers, kasi siempre lahat gusto to. Even in states, the demand is really sky has really skyrocketed. The demand in Japan is super narente sa atin, di ba? Para sobrang crazy ni mga price ng Land Cruiser. So this 40 for me is really really nice, kasi. Eto talaga guys, legit. Pag dinanong mo, pag bibigyan mo na to, I promise you this would be one of my dream cars. So, sobrang solid. So, may mga Spectre Off-Road din to na... Ayan, may mga Spectre Off-Road na mods. Kasi, uh, they went to US, tama ba? Pumunta silang US to order these parts para this, for this 40. So, ganun kalupit si Uncle. The PTO, I think this is a Orig Toyota. Ayan, no? may Toyota logo na old school. PTO winches, or Orig Toyota. Lahat panalo. Sobrang panalo. Classic PIAA headlights. Ganda, ang ganda. Pati yung kulay guys. Yung kulay yung for me, stands out. Yung tires niya, Tolentine talagang tama naman, pantayo hindi siya yung mga... <laughs> oh still bro, kahit pantayo yan, ganyan yung mga itsura dapat ng mga 40. Ganda bro, grabe. So ito yung mga... Okay, sorry hindi ako move on dito sa otong to. But promise, this car looks freaking nice. Pag ito natapos, dadalhin sa Manila, dadalhin sa Manila. Oh shit. <laughs> Pang ESTE bandaw ni Aisy to pag natapos. But still, the car is really nice, guys. 
Papakita ko lang ulit sa inyo yung fleet. So, there's a 40 here. Meron tayong pickup na 1HDT. Meron din tayo naka 3. Sorry, naka 3F na pickup again. Tapos, ito yung fire truck na naka 1HDT na 80 na Matic. Tapos, 79 na reprod. And then, 76 na reprod. So, ganun kalupet. There. So, sobrang lupet. But, have you, kita nyo naman. LC2, Toyota, 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 Toyota. There's a Suzuki, two Suzuki, but of course, hindi magpapat, hindi magpapatalo. There's a Mitsubishi here. So there, this one, this car, uh, it's really nice because uh, alam nyo naman, Pajero is pa, it's still Pajero. Even though we love Land Cruisers, Pajero is still Pajero. So this one's really rare because this is a three-door Pajero running on gram lights. Na 50, ano to? Na, I forgot. 6x139, sorry, 20 siya na... Oh, 20s. I forgot eh, gram lights to na... 57 dr ba to? I forgot, I forgot the name of this gram lights. But still, this is a 20s one na may center cap. Ang ganda kasi simple lang, stock height. Pang daily lang talaga. Updated suspension na din siya bro, na rancho. Ah, naka-rancho na. Tapos gold yung mga ano niya. Yung mga emblems niya. Ayan, gold. GLS, Pajero, gold. Ganda, ganda. Sa cousin namin to eh. O yun, sa cousin namin. Andun siya, andun siya. So yun, really nice car Chelsea. <laughs> so yun, ang ganda, ang ganda. It's a good daily car. It's a diesel, di ba? Tapos yung itsura mo, boss. Okay, hindi pa nagtatapos dun. May mga kotsa dito, kita nyo naman. May, may, may simple yung mga motorcycles there. So yun. And then, of course, si Tito, nag-GGS din. <laughs> so R1250 na GS. I'm not really particular with the model of this kinds of cars, pero this one's a GS R R1250 na GS exclusive. I don't know if this is limited. I don't know if what's the mods of this motorcycle. I'm not really good with motorcycle, but GS is still GS. I have tried to uh, I tried already tried to sit on one of a GS na modelo para ang sobrang taas, sobrang hirap gamitin but still, sobrang lupit tong GS na to kasi mahal yung mga yan so yun, meron din silang ano dito, si ano to? CRF? ah, CRF ito yung mga pinapang bundok eh, ba? tama so yan, yung mga nagtitrail na mga motor ito yun so yun Kinuha lang? Kaya ito buko. Oo. Pumunta ng bundok eh. Pumunta ng bundok. Kumuha lang. Kumuha lang. Kumuha lang. Kasi nauhaw eh. Nauhaw. Para mamaya buko juice tayo. Buko juice. Ito na yan. Pang kasaba kay Kilo Boss. Ay. Ah, pang kasaba kay. Mayroon din ko pa tayo. So, yan. So, this is the fleet. This is the dream fleet. Let's be honest. Kahit naman yung mga may yaman dyan. Kahit yung mga tayo. Alam natin na ito talaga yung pangarap nating fleet. Diba? Freak! Sobrang solid, sobrang solid. So there you go. Uh, again, ano bro? Speechless na naman, as usual. Speechless. Sobrang panalo. Diba? But di ako na mas, uh, nagpa-anti dyan kami. Magkakasama yeah. kami in the house. Nagpa-anti dyan kami lahat. We're all negative guys. So, and please don't observed, bash. Ano, and we observed na Social before, we, before we met up last weekend, five days, two weeks ata tayo di nakita kita. Yes. Hindi tayo lumabas lahat. No? Yes. Tapos yun, nagpa-anti dyan kami before going to the house. So guys, disclaimer lang, we're all safe here. So yun guys, uh, thank you for watching of course for this uh, simple vlog. Siyempre, dire-direcho lang to, pasensya na. But still, thank you for watching. Diyan yung mga tropa natin. So please do like this video, subscribe on our YouTube channel, Banawe Boy. And of course, our social media platforms, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Banawe Boy, No Space.